Hi, I'm Warren Nash, and here is how to make a shepherd's pie using the Tefal Ingenio range of saucepans. This recipe will serve six to eight people, and you'll need to preheat your oven to 180 degrees centigrade. And to start, you'll need to get one and a half kilograms worth of potatoes and then peel them. Then roughly chop and then rinse them under the tap. Then get your Ingenio range of pans and take out one large saucepan. Place the potatoes into the saucepan and then fill with water until they're just covered. Now place the potatoes over a high heat on the hob and then place the lid on. Then bring up to simmering point and leave to simmer away for about 20 to 25 minutes. And in the meantime we can prepare the filling. So take two onions, peel them and then finely dice. Then dice two carrots that have been peeled as well as one stalk of celery. Now take an Ingenio saute pan and then place over a high heat on the hob. Then pour in four tablespoons worth of vegetable oil and allow to heat up. And once the oil is heated, pour in the diced onions and the diced carrots and celery. You now need to saute the vegetables for about five minutes without allowing them to brown. After five minutes, take one kilogram worth of minced lamb and pour it into the pan or minced beef if you want to make a cottage pie. Now season with some salt and pepper and then saute well until the meat is brown. Now the meat is browned, you then need to add two tablespoons worth of tomato puree and two crushed garlic cloves. Briefly stir the ingredients in and then continue to cook away for a further two to three minutes. You then need to add 800 millilitres worth of beef stock using two stock cubes, as well as the leaves from two sprigs of thyme and two bay leaves. Now leave it to simmer away for between 30 and 45 minutes until the sauce has thickened up nicely. And meanwhile, when the potatoes are cooked and they're nice and soft when cut into, remove from the heat. Now attach the Ingenio straining lid and carefully drain out the water. Now add 160 millilitres worth of milk, 100 grams worth of unsalted butter and a pinch of nutmeg to the potatoes. Leave the butter to briefly melt and then using a masher, begin mashing the potatoes. Keep at it, and when the potato is lovely and smooth, set the mashed potato aside whilst we wait for the filling to simmer down. So, when everything in the filling is well cooked and the sauce has thickened up nicely, check for seasoning and then remove from the heat. Transfer the saute pan onto a heat proof surface and then begin spreading the mashed potato over the top of the filling using a spatula. When it's covered, use a spatula to smooth out the top of the shepherd's pie. Then use a fork to decorate the top with some lines as well as dotting it with some butter. And then you should be left with a lovely looking shepherd's pie that's ready for the oven. So using the detachable handle, place the saute pan into the oven once it's heated up to 180 degrees centigrade for about 30 minutes. And you'll know your shepherd's pie is ready when it's lovely and crisp and golden on top. So use the handle to remove the saute pan from the oven and then serve immediately at the table. And this shepherd's pie goes great, served with a fresh green salad or your favourite vegetables. And remember, this shepherd's pie can serve six to eight people. So if you do have any left over, simply place on an Ingenio Hermetic lid onto the saute pan and then place into the fridge once cooled to store. And be sure to check out more recipes made by me using the Tefal Ingenio range of saucepans.